grew up in the area. Uh, there wasn't really much here. It was just kind of a wide space in the road. And we've gone through a tremendous redevelopment over the past 20 years. Smyrna is a small town becoming a medium-sized city. Hope Lock is a town in East Central Alabama, at approximately 25,000 people. We have a great economic development effort. We had an outdated network that we built in the mid-90s. There was no voicemail. It was limited in the way you could announce calls, with conferencing, and trying to get a, a message after hours. We wanted to really increase the convergence of technology via the phone system. But to be able to support that upgrade, we had to upgrade the network also. We did have a lot of issues. Our library had a PBX, and everything else was using services from Bell South at the time. So they didn't always interact well. The police department, they had computers in the cars. They had no way of connecting the cars to the rest of our network. The other problem was the phone units were no longer in production, and they were failing. There are challenges and opportunities at Opelika. Uh, the, the opportunity was to take advantage of the fiber network, but the challenge was to have a centralized environment to do a bunch of different applications, including unified messaging, uh, integrated fax, broadcast messaging, call recording, and uh, wireless applications. With Smyrna, a lot of the police and fire agencies and uh, other state agencies can interoperate, but if you look at an organization like a public works department, they don't have that capability to integrate. So in terms of emergency like a tornado, it's very important to come up with a solution. We were able to do that with a call manager solution. The, the applications really drive the technology rather than the technology driving the applications. The requirements were outlined. Both the city of Smyrna and the city of Opelika had Cisco infrastructure um, in their network. We took the requirements and then put together a partnership with Sistera and Cisco to deliver that in solution. Partnering with Cisco um, has been a good experience. They actually make sure that they partner well um, with third-party ISVs like Sistera uh, to make sure that their system works well with third-party um, solution sets. That's a big deal for us so that we have the ability when we do want to come in uh, and help support a digital in adding additional value to their customers. Because Cisco has an open platform, it allows us to be able to connect a lot of the various systems together and do some of the advanced capabilities on top of the infrastructure that Cisco puts in place. And you know, that's one of the fun things about my job is getting to work with end users. When you see like a, a big burly detective and we show him one of our products and his eyes just light up, these are things they've never had before. We're now able to receive faxes um, through our computer, which is right at my desk. I can receive it in my email and print it out there in my office where no one's around to view the sensitive material. It makes working my cases easier and it's a lot, you know, more secure. We've now got, you know, wireless hotspots throughout the city specifically for our public safety people to pull in push their reports to our servers and police don't have to come off their beats either they'll pretty much have everything on a screen in their car that they would have in their office rapid broadcast is Cicero's answer to doing a lot of features via the, the telephone it gives us an opportunity from from here to notify all of our stations at one time or one at a time. We can do a rapid broadcast over all the phones and all the speaker systems, advise them what's going on and if there's any action they need to take. One of the most important things is that we don't miss phone calls. The iDivert system will allow me to push a button when I'm on a line and it sends the second incoming call to my voicemail. If I pull up their number from the directories on the Cisco system and call them back, they're just like, how did you know to call me back? How did you get my number? And thank you so much for calling me back. It, it makes all the difference in the world. Sister so, so nailed it for us in, in both Smyrna and Opelika. And it goes beyond the phone. It goes to the uh, platform that this is going to build for the long-term use uh, of the, the community. Their convergence server and the platform it provides can allow us to do many different things for our clients. Their rapid broadcast function, their uh, quick record, their call center record, their quick connect, all solve problems that our customers face on a daily basis. They took my input and by putting 
their ideas, our ideas, and, and what we wanted in a finished product, I think we came up with a, a real good solution. I felt like uh, when it came time to put an integrated solution together, it was going to work. Yeah, and it has worked. Yeah. It's an honor to be one of the select partners in the program. We view that I, Cisco's ISPN is going to be a framework for us to be able to engage with partners around the world as they bring in solid solutions to solve their customers' challenges. The productivity pieces that we've put in place make our employees work smarter. And that, that's where I see is our key return on investment. Uh, I don't really make my decisions entirely on price anyway, because if I'm going to have to maintain it and manage it, I want something that I know is going to make my job a little easier.